Hey there, my friends, this is Argon Matrix, welcoming you to episode 37 of The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. I'm on a boat. Okay, so last time, we, um, we got the Zora's Mask, and that's really about it. So what's over this way? Now rehearsing at Zora Hall, the Zora Band with the deep sea sound, the Indigogos. Ooh, where have we heard that name before? I'll tell you where, in the mayor's office. That's right. Alright, so here... Let me see. There's some. There's a Zora over here. Hey, hey, buddy, what do you want? Can you break all those jars behind me in one try? Among, among us, Zora, there are some who can. If you do it, I'll give you something good. Something good, eh? Well, let's try it. I think the best way to do this would probably be to do something like that. Oh, not quite. Have I lost my touch? Have you lost a touch of playing the guitar? Too much guitar, Mikau? You need to be able to break all these pots at once. Uh huh. Oh, take ten rupees for the broken jars. Well, I know you don't get a heart piece for this. At least I don't think you do. But I'm just gonna keep, I'm just gonna try one more time, I guess. Oh damn it! Yeah, yeah, whatever, dude. Stop it! Stop it! No! Stop taking my money, punk! All right. Oh, well, I was gonna do other stuff though. Now that I have the Zora's Mask, because there's actually a few heart pieces that I would like to get, namely two, that I can think of, that you need the Zora's Mask to get. The Zora's Mask, among other things that we have. Okay, so, uh, first thing, you, first area that we're going to go to is just outside the Great Bay Coast, actually. In that area that we thought was the ocean, but we were duped into thinking so. Even though there's like very little water, so I don't know why anyone would think it was an ocean. Okay. Hey, no. Ah, stupid. Oh my goodness, Epona. Just get around the fence. Thank you. Okay. This doesn't seem like the perfect time to be doing this to, because, like, don't want to interrupt story progression but to get heart pieces, but you know what? Oh, dude, dude, stop. Stop jumping fences. Jeez. That's, like, the first time I've ever not wanted Epona to jump the fences, and then she does anyways. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this rock right here, we're gonna want to destroy it right quick. And watch it go boom! Thank you. And if you head down, you will see a really interesting looking hole. Hmm, what are these things? Baba. Just calm down and aim carefully, and don't blame me if one hit doesn't get rid of it. Well, I won't. Okay, so I guess we'll get our arrows out. Seems like the best way to deal with these guys. Hey there. Ha, uh, two hits. Yeah, so basically two hit kills for these guys. No major thing. Hey. I said get down. And... Pwned. Alright, one more should be over there. I don't know. Okay, but we're not here for that, I don't think. Uh, well, actually we are. Because that's something involved in... Uh, getting this heart piece in here. Okay, so you need to destroy all these beehives and kill the all the monsters, I think. And oh, lo and behold, there's a heart piece down there somehow. How do we make that appear? Who knows, but... And you can actually come down here earlier, like a lot earlier, and I did for one of my recording sessions. But, um... Hey, what the heck? But... If you don't have the Zora's Mask, you can't actually get the heart piece. As you will see. Okay, yeah. So press B to, like, sink to the bottom. And heart piece! Which makes a brand new heart container. God, look at those long, skinny hands of the Zora. Jeez. Never really noticed that. And resurface. Come on, Link. Float faster. Thank you. Now... That's the that's one of the two heart pieces that I want to get. The second one we're gonna need to warp for, or it's more convenient to warp anyways. It's gonna be in the mountain village. Yeah, that's right, mountain village. You heard me, the mountain village. Actually, which one's closer? Mountain village is closer, by far. Oh yeah. And this is the reason that I beat Got before this recording session, so that. The water will be all thought out here, since there is a heart piece underwater in this general area. Um, 
Get our bunny ears, make this go a little bit faster. Better, faster, stronger. Alright, go away grass, I hate you. Now, that's a big tree. Holy balls. And the pattern of the leaves kind of looks like a snowflake or something. What am I doing? Oh my goodness. Ah, I just like stop to admire a tree. It's like, damn, that's one fine tree, boy. Okay, you can just die. Thanks. And now hop into the water here. Um, actually, can I? Yeah, you can put it on the water. The Zora's map in the water. I would think so. And here's this chest. I think I might have made note of it when we first saw it under the ice, but maybe not. And what could it possibly be? Oh my god, it's a heart piece. Who'd have thunk? Alright, and I'm pretty sure that that's really all I wanted to all the heart pieces I wanted to get in this, um, with the Zora's mask outside of, like, the Great Bay Coast. So let's go ahead and move out. Oh my god! Skeleton fish. What are you? Isn't that a skull fish? Don't ask me about everything, alright? <laughs> I'm sorry. Excuse me. Excuse me, princess. Alright. Now, let's go ahead and head back out to the Great Bay Coast. What do you say? Get this truck rolling already. Oh, wait. Okay. So, the Great Bay Coast is way out there. In the middle of nowhere. Not close to any of our other warp locations. Breaking the pattern here, Great Bay Coast. And, ooh. That's a nice little random panning shot. I kind of like that. Alright. And... Swim! Ah. Uh, when you hear the birds, like, chirping or whatever, making their sound, it sounds so, like, horrible underneath the water. Everything in this game sounds horrible underneath the water. Like, really, just listen to any sound from this game underwater, and it's not too pleasant, because it, like, fluctuates, and it's really weird. Okay, how much time are we at? Seven and a half minutes? Not bad. Not bad at all. So, let's go exploring for a little bit here. Let's take a look around. Hmm. This place is rather interesting, I must say. Here's a nice little waterfall. Ooh, that's cool. Uh, fall headwaters. Beaver's home. Beware of swift currents. Well, we are a Zora now, or we have the ability to become a Zora, anyways. Um, oh, there's a... Oh, crap! What the... No! Is he gonna eat something of mine? Well, apparently not. Hey, go away. Thank you. Now I'm gonna go ahead and... Kill you! Kill you! No! Stupid. Okay. Maybe I should just, um... Okay. Oh, by the way, you do want to kill this lake-like. Okay, surface. Now let's swim. And... Okay, swim down, down, there we go, Is that, that's one hit, and come around, come around like a torpedo, snap, I think I killed him, and for that, I'm going to go ahead and dive, there's a heart piece, yeah, do you really expect that, heart piece and 20 rupees to boot, it's like yeah, you get a heart piece and a free 20 rupees, and a brand new car. Okay. So apparently those weren't the only two harpies I could get with the Zora's mask. I didn't realize that that one would be so simple. Anyways. Um. Now we're just kind of in this random basin of water. Uh. Do I want to pick up those fish right now? Actually, yeah, I do. Oh, no, wait, no, I don't. Because I'm going to get another bottle here pretty soon, I think. Um, what happens if I go, can I go behind that waterfall? I can't tell. I'm wasting time. Go behind the waterfall. Okay, you can, but there's just a wall there. Okay, so, I'll do that fish thing later, I suppose. Stop swimming into the wall. Damn it. Okay, oh, I hear the bells. They are tolling. Alright, so now that we have the heart all the heart pieces that I want to get right now out of the way, 
let's go ahead and see what's happening in the Zora Hall. That seems to be the area that people are talking about right now. Maybe there's something of consequence over there. It would seem that that's it over there, the giant shrine of awesomeness. Hanging out in the distance. So let's go Zora mode. And, oh, night of the first day. Way to ruin my fun. Okay, and swim, little fishy. Sw nope, stupid skullfish. Alright, uh, doesn't seem to be too much around here. Nice little scenery. Oh, hello, there's a lifelike in here. Why do they have a lifelike guarding this place? Hmm. The Zora Hall Head. Now rehearsing the Zora Band with that deep sea sound, the Indigo Goes. Alright, let's check it out. Oh, anyone recognize that music? The nice, calming, serenity music from Zora's Domain. Oh, how I missed you. Mm, just bask in its glory for a little bit. Okay, so let's go ahead and just be Link for a little bit here since he moves faster. Let's start talking to people. Did you come to see the Indiegogos rehearse too? No? Have you heard of the Indiegogos? Of course, duh. They play Battle of the Windfish and stuff. I thought so. The Indiegogos are pretty big now, aren't they? Their rehearsal is about to begin, so I thought you came to see them. Well, maybe I did. Of course, their guitar player is kind of dead now, but... Oh, well. So, let's go ahead and, start, head and just start exploring. I'm literally like... Okay, this is a shop. I don't really need that right now. I'm literally doing this mostly or partially blind here, because... I don't really remember where I'm supposed to go at all times. Oh, well, here's an owl statue. That's nice. I remembered that guy. And that if you don't hit him, he can be it can be a pain in the ass to get back here. Okay, got some bombs and a fairy, which I don't really need. Oh, hello. Hey, hey shut the, that's the girl from the cutscene. Cool. But let's check the sign first. Great Bay Temple ahead. Swimming prohibited due to murky water. Hmm. Let's see. Okay. Well, forget you then. I guess we'll deal with her later. Okay. This is the room of Mikau and, and Tiho, the guitarist and the drummer for the Zor Zora Band, the Indiegogos. They don't meet with ordinary people. Well, does Mikau meet with Mikau? Hey, Mikau. I haven't seen you in a while. Where have you been? Well, that's right. Evan, your band leader, is looking for you. Okay, well, I just... I don't want to talk to him, because... I don't know him, and my mom and told me not to talk to strangers. Uh... Mikau, where have you been? We've been looking everywhere. I was worried. The concert is t in t the concert in town is coming up, but it seems like all the band members are in a funk. I bet you didn't know that, huh? <laughs> Especially Lulu. I haven't heard her voice in a long time. She's usually in good spirits too. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I wonder if this is related to the ocean turning out weird. Actually, I know a little bit of Lulu's secret. Do you want to hear it? Oh yeah, secret time. Spill the beans, buddy. There's a rumor that the ocean is getting weird because there's a trouble offshore at the Great Bay Temple. And they say that when that happens, sometimes bad will be followed so the descendant who's been protecting the temple. Do you catch my drift? And lately, Lulu has been, ki has been looking kind of weird. Maybe Lulu's the... The Descendant? Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're telling me? I think I'm picking up what you're putting down, buddy. Is there stuff down here? Doesn't really look like it. Nothing much here. Oh, well. So let's just go ahead and keep exploring, I guess. La la la. Ah, uh, 14 minutes. And eh, we have a little bit more time to explore. Okay. Hey, cow, do you need to see Japas? You're gonna need to have another jam session with them, aren't you? I can't wait! Oh yeah, let's have a jam session. That sounds like a good old time. Hey, buddy, what you what you doing? Um, can I, can I speak? Thank you, Macau. Where have you been? I'm all like, hey, where's Macau? The concert's coming up soon, and our band leader has pulled a vanish act. Evan's all holed up in his room, just writing songs. And to top it off, Lulu just stands out staring back, staring at the seat. She doesn't even respond when you talk to her. If you guys think it's just because Lulu's not interested in me, I'll understand. But I'm telling you, it looks like something's really wrong. Is that something you're trying to hide from me? I'm not running any inquiry or anything. 
But it looks like if we don't start rehearsing real soon, we're not going to be ready for the concert. Okay, let's let's jam. I want to have a da jam session. Damn session. <laughs> Try following the phrase I wrote on your guitar. Okay. Okay, that's not right. Apparently, uh, yeah, I want to stop. Because I don't know the rhythm. I, I don't have a feel for the beat, man. I ain't got no rhythm. I ain't got no rhythm. Okay. Um, well, we seem to have run into a bit of a dilemma around here. In the Great Hall, or the Zora Hall. So, next time, I guess we'll explore a little bit more and see what we can uncover around here. So, until then, thank you everyone for watching. This is Argon Matrix, signing out. Thank you, and good night.